The 2008 NASCAR Nationwide season is history, and there's the champion waiting very patiently for his car has been staged over in turn two because they're going to get the victory stage set up. And while we wait to talk with the champion, let's go down and talk with the race winner, Carl Edwards in victory lane. And Carl Edwards climbing victoriously from his machine. Wow, yet another victory. The way you ended the season with a flourish, but for this one, you had to hold off the hottest driver in the series this year, Kyle Busch. What was that restart like with him right behind you? Um, man, that's a great that's a great win. I mean, to be able to hold off 18 as strong as they are, that's uh, that was a good race. I had a really good time. Congratulations to Clint and those guys. It's a class act. It's uh, it's no good to finish second in the championship, but I know he'll be a good uh, champion for Nationwide and. I got to get beat by somebody. It's uh, a dirt racer from Emporia, Kansas, is uh, is the best uh, best guy to get beat by. But save a lot, Scotts, um, World Financial Group, Under Armour, Ford Motor Company, especially the fans for uh, for showing up such great numbers for these nationwide events. You made it incredibly exciting over the last month or so. Came up just 21 points short. How would you describe? the battle for this championship this year as it came down to this closing race. Well, one of the neatest things about this series, uh, you know, about the championship is it's different from the Cup Series. It's all season. You know, it's not it's not tonight that, that determine this championship. So we'll be back next year. I hope Clint comes back and uh, races with us. That'd be fun. And the great thing is I think we have a lot to look forward to. We've got a great team uh, both here and on the Cup side. And uh, there's no shame in giving it 100 percent effort and finishing second. That's the best we could do. Congratulations. Thank you. And Doc, he's still got another shot at yet another title. Needs a lot of help, but he could be the champion tomorrow. Ian has made his way around to begin the celebration with his team. Dave Burns is there. He's been waiting patiently over in turn two. Here's Carl to congratulate. Yeah! Well, you've rubbed fenders with him all year. He got the up sometimes, you got the up sometimes, but in the end, you are the champion. What was it like beating Carl Edwards this race this year? You know, we've uh, we've raced a long time. We're both from the Midwest, so he's a good competitor. He was last year's champion. It feels uh, really good to be able to beat him. Uh, you know, Dan Deeringhoff and all these guys in the bb and Chevrolet, they've just done a, a good job all year long. We've been consistent. We did the things it takes to win championships. Richard, you know, for giving me the opportunity. Uh, bb and uh, Camping World, everybody involved. Chevrolet, Monte Carlo. How about that? Beat that Ford. So, uh, you know, just uh, incredible. I'm so excited for everybody. Clint, you were a NASCAR regional champion, and now you're on the national stage. Got that phone call. How did we get here? <laughs> I have no idea, but, uh, you know, I think it's just Carl and I both are, uh, you know, um, uh, it just goes to show you that uh, the, the stepping stones that NASCAR has put forth for us uh, young drivers to come up through the ranks and have a shot at this can do it. Uh, we both were, you know, weekly racing champions, racing the regional championships, and, uh, you know, kids at home, uh, yeah, they should go for it. Describe knowing when the caution came out that you had to be on pins and needles for a little while longer. No, oh, man, I was getting tight. Uh, you know, we just got real, real tight, and, and I really didn't want to see it, but, uh, you know, in hindsight, it, it worked out. I want to thank my teammates, everybody, uh, Kevin and, and Jeff Burton and, uh, you know, Wimmer right there at the end. He, he watched my back, and that's what teamwork's all about. Really hope Wimmer, you know, lands a ride. He deserves it. He's a hell of a race car driver. Clint Boyer is your 2008 Nationwide Series champion down on the stage to make this all very, very official, joined by NASCAR's President Mike Helton, who's going to congratulate our 2008 driver champion. Clint, congratulations. You guys, uh, you and RCR did a nice job this year, along with Joe Gibbs Racing, uh, to put on a heck of a program for the whole Nationwide Series. We're proud to have you as our 08 Nationwide Series champion, and congratulations from all of NASCAR. I appreciate it. Uh, it's a dream come true. It really is. Uh, you know, coming up, uh, Carl and I both, you know, race for a championship, came up through the stepping stones of NASCAR, and uh, that's what it's all about right there. So really proud. Thank you. Kudos to Clint and car owner Richard Childress, but finishing just ahead of him in the Owner's Point Championship this year was the 20 team of Joe Gibbs Racing. And right now, John Amon, Associate Vice President of Strategic Sponsorship for Nationwide Insurance, will present the trophy to J.D. Gibbs. John. But J.D., on behalf of all of Nationwide, congratulations on a great season. This is excellent. Happy to present to you this trophy. Right. 
Thank you. We appreciate Nationwide sub, sub, support so much. And a big hats off to, to all the guys on Richard's team. And Clint has a great finish there. And for us, it was just to have uh, Joey in the car, Danny in the car, you know, between Kyle and Tony. It was great to wrap up. It means a lot to us. And we sure will treasure this forever. Thank you. Great. Two champions crowned tonight on the big stage at Homestead Miami Speedway. Alan? All right, David, thank you. So the uh, award ceremony and the official presentation of the rings and the checks and all the rest of that happens next Saturday night in Orlando, Florida for Clint Boyer and his team and J.D. Gibbs and the 20 team and the final championship standings as we get a final thought from this 2008 season. Just a fantastic job for Clint Boyer. Now we can talk to Clint and call him champ. And it's got a nice ring to it. Outstanding. He led this thing from wire to wire. He dealt with the pressure. He reacted like a champion, responded like a champion, and he is the champion. And congratulations to Clinton, Richard, and everybody. We know that Clint's a great driver, but let's not forget about Dan Deerhoff and what those guys did last week at Phoenix. And then to take that car tonight, make it better, get him a good crucial pit stop. I think that the championship team is right there, too. That yeah, was an uh, outstanding, uh, outstanding season for all. Congratulations to all. Let's go upstairs. Doc, DJ, and Andy, a final thought? Well, what a what a time for a performance for these guys here. The, the two car getting it done here. The last race of the year in a championship performance here on the night when they had to have it. Yeah, you see a difference with the Clint Boyer's team. They raced for this championship from day one. They only won one race, but they knew the big prize was right here on this stage tonight. Yeah, he did a terrific job. Everything that they had to do, and I think as they look back, there's going to be a lot of things that they can say, well, that made a difference. But last week, just like Ray said, at Phoenix, that was a great effort on their part. But the tremendous amount of pressure that you come into this last race, knowing what you have to do and going out and doing it. Uh, my hat's off to Clint, a great champion, going to be a great champion for the sport, and to Richard Childress, who's put so much into not only this nationwide series, but uh, into Sprint Cup racing and all of NASCAR racing for a long time. A young man from the Midwest from Emporia. Kansas who got a phone call five years ago from Richard Childress to give him a chance to come to NASCAR and tonight he realized a dream. Alan. All right Doc thanks so two champions determined thus far this weekend here at Homestead Miami Speedway the third set tomorrow in the Ford 400 the final race in the chase for the NASCAR Sprint Cup Jimmy Johnson in position to well claim the title Carl Edwards still with an outside shot at the championship but of course Jimmy Johnson with a commanding lead and provided nothing really goes askew for him on Sunday he will equal the great Cale Yarborough as the only driver ever to win three consecutive cup championships history in the making here in South Florida on Sunday now the trick to that is Jimmy starts 30th Carl Edwards starts fourth it should be some some anxious moments in the early going uh, definitely some anxious moments early in the race being that far back in the pack like Johnson is he's got to be real careful I believe he can lock this thing up with no problem but he can't mess up and there's a chance that could happen there's a hornet's nest going on back at the 35th <laughs> spot fighting for that 35th position so there's going to be some tumultuous times around him he's gonna have to be really careful tomorrow Carl's not worried about it he's gonna put an exclamation point on this season he's going after the win all right, so uh, one uh, one champion's trophy uh, held tonight by Clint Boyer. Johnny Benson crowned the NASCAR Craftsman Truck Series champion last night. Tomorrow, most likely Jimmy Johnson with that third consecutive NASCAR Sprint Cup. And we will be here with uh, every bit of the action for you tomorrow, starting at 3 Eastern time on ABC. ESPN2 College Football Scoreboard is up next. Congratulations to Carl Edwards, winner of tonight's race. And there is Clint Boyer, your 2008 NASCAR Nationwide Series champion. It all started 10 months ago at Daytona. Crisscrossing the country all this time and when it came down to the final months of the season, Carl Edwards with a tremendous rally but consistent Clint running up front each and every week had what it took. Best average finish and the driver from Emporia, Kansas has taken home the trophy as the 2008 NASCAR Nationwide Series champion. For our entire ESPN NASCAR crew, Alan Bestwick saying so long from Homestead Miami Speedway. Join us tomorrow at 3 Eastern for the Sprint Cup finale.